Hello Seekers, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, my darlings. Today's reading is for Aries. Aries, my darling, today's your day to shine. Please shine bright like a diamond. Also, please make a friend and know that if the reading does not resonate to your present situation, please do not get hurt, offended, or in your feelings. It only simply means today that the reading is not for you, but if you come back a different day, that one just might be. Also, if it's your first time here and you have not yet subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe right now. Turn the post notification on so that you won't miss another upload, okay? For all my returning seekers, know that I love you guys so, 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 so much. Thank you for all the love and support that you show each and every day. I see the love and I am embracing all that good love. Um, I'm hoping that you'll be able to hear me pretty clear because um, my mic is in my suitcase. I just got back home from Jamaica. And I do not feel like going through my luggage, y'all, to get that mic out. So, bear with your girl until I get everything all set up, okay? Now, this reading today is um, what's coming towards you for the next three months, okay? Uh, this is highly requested. And I figured, just like, even though I'm kind of tired, y'all, um, I had a very long flight. Yes, I sure did. Had a couple of layovers and all that other stuff. But anyway, your girl is here with the blessing. This um, message, like I said before, is just to let you guys know what is coming towards you for the next three months. Love, um, your financial issues, and forward movement moving on, okay? So I'm going to say a prayer um, as well. And I do notice, I got to say this, y'all. I do notice that some people is commenting about they have been forwarding the prayer section of the reading. Honey, baby, you are forwarding your blessing, okay? So if you just want to get straight into the reading, the reading is not what you need. You need Jesus in your life, okay? So if you're forwarding the prayer part of the reading, the most essential part of your reading, you don't. it doesn't make any sense to even listen to the remainder of the reading because you already lost your blessing right there, okay? Ain't nothing going to come good of whatever you're searching for because you have already forwarded your blessing, okay? Just know that. Now, Heavenly Father, we're going to say a prayer um, to you, and then we get right on into it. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send on your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading, using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the seekers for the ones that need to know. Heavenly Father, I give you all the honor and I give you all the praises. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. All right, so I'm just going to pull three cards for each of whatever it is that the angel wants you to know. Let's do um, what's going on for you right now as far as your money is concerned, okay? Your finances is concerned because that, honey, we got to work on that finances, right? We all want to know what's going on with our stash. So messages, please. And we have three cards here. All right. The page of cups coming up. All right, I see some money thing coming through. Um, see, like your finances, it's kind of coming in for some of you, but it's kind of coming in really, really slow here. Um, you're, it's not really where you want it to be. I also feel like you might be getting some kind of apology for some of you you're on a job where it's really going so, so. I see you having some issues on your job with other people. I feel like something might have happened on your job where your money's flowing. An apology is coming towards you on your job. Somebody's messing with your money, period, all right? You should be further than where you are, but some issues is coming around you for sure, all right? You're having some issues. Somebody's slowing your money. Somebody is slowing down your progress here. Your progress is not going in the direction that you need it to be going into. I also feel like right here in the two of cups here, I feel like, or your money is concerned here. Um, someone might want to share something with you. Um, as far as your money is concerned, someone, um, I feel like someone is watching you, okay, from a distance with your money. I feel like this person might want to say something, want to come in with an offer. I also feel like you might be making plans, maybe moving away from this present situation that you are in. Um, because I feel like you definitely want better things. Better things for your life. But huh, the thing is, the Ten of Wands is also telling me here that you, you de it's definitely not going right. Your money flow where you, your money is flowing right now in the position where you found yourself in right now in the Page of Cups. In the Ten of Wands here, you're trying to hold things together. I feel like you're scared of letting go. 
your job situation, um, you're, you're holding on for dear life. You're holding on for dear life. But I feel like you're, you're kind of stuck as well. You're kind of waiting around for a better offer, for an offer. Maybe for some of you, you have, you're thinking about getting a promotion on your job. I feel like promotion, someone wants to give it to you, but I also feel like someone is stopping your blessing from coming in. There's someone around you in your circle where you're working at that is giving you some kind of a hard time there. And because of that, you're not making the money that you need to be making, Aries. Something is blocking your happy. It's just... It's, I feel like you're stuck with that one pay rate for a long time. It is not moving accordingly. It is not moving accordingly because the two of cups is telling me that someone is my, someone wants to give you something. Someone maybe want to share something with you, but this person is kind of blocking. Someone is blocking your happy on your job. Okay, your happy is blocking your progress. Your growth has been blocked by someone by something, and you. I've already been trying to sustain this and to hold this together using that one little small paycheck right here, okay, to pay all these bills here. Someone is coming with a project because someone is stopping your your happy here, okay? Because on the back of your deck right here, the Ace of Cups right here is letting me know as well that new something new might be coming in for you. I feel like there's um maybe an idea. That might be coming in in the ace of in the ace of cups here. Um, I see growth coming in. I see someone is coming in telling you the truth about something. Someone is going to fess up because the apology is coming here, right? That apology is coming. It is coming your way. Um, I definitely see where your 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 growth is very stunted here. You're stunted like you're stuck in this place right here. I also feel like. Um, as where your money is flowing, joy and, 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 and growth is there, but there's one particular person who's giving you a hard ass time here, very hard time here. And that hard time is causing you not to have forward movement because you're trying to hold everything in. You may be trying to hold in, um, what's going on around you in your circle and you as well as you might trying to hold on to that little bit of money to stretch to pay those bills. All right. So let me see what angels are saying here. What angel wants you to know um, for your uh, love life. All right. Angels, let me have some messages here, please. Let me have some messages here for Aries, please. Messages for Aries love life. What's going on with Aries, Aries person? Okay. What's going on for Aries, Aries person here? Okay. The magician in the reverse. The fool here. Okay. Someone wants to jump back into the sack with you, honey. See, someone wants to come back. This person wants to come back. Someone really wants to come back here. Yeah, someone wants to talk. I feel like your person and you might have had a falling out already. Because in the magician here, that came through in the reverse. I feel like this person here, all right, they're very destructive towards you. I feel like they might have done some grimy stuff to you, hurtful things, hurtful words is what I'm feeling. And that person might have walked away from you, okay? feel like there's definitely a separation here already. The fool is letting me know that in the magician here, that person wants to jump back in. They want to come back to you. They want to start a new. They want to see if they could pick up uh, the pieces that was left. I feel like this person also wants, an apology, wants to apologize to you because I did see apology coming towards you. Um, as far as your money is concerned, and I also feel wherever that money is flowing, where the apology is coming towards you for your money, that apology is also coming in towards you as far as your love life is concerned as well, because someone wants to jump back into your, into your good graces. Okay. Um, the page of Pentacles is also telling me here that that someone wants to talk. They want to talk to you. They definitely want to talk to you. They want to come back. They want to make amends. This person want to make amends with you. They want to beg. They want to plead their case. All right. They plead in the fifth here. And the back of your card here. All right. Um, the nine of wands came up. The nine of pentacles came up here. Okay. I feel like this person here, um, they might want to find a new way to love you all over again. Okay. Um, I feel like this person also, they might have... Um, an idea about making money with you, growing with you, um, stability with you, eight of pentacles here. Yeah, that's coming through here. 
They want to come up with an idea about money. Not just they want to um, maybe get back into your good graces, but that per this person, I feel like they want to talk to you about making some money, maybe some money ideas. Maybe you did make money with this person um, in the past. They are definitely thinking about coming back to you, okay? They want to come back. They want to help. They want to help here, okay? They definitely want to help. Um, the Six of Pentacles here, they want to help you. This person wants to help you into some kind of an idea with where your money is flowing, okay? All right, let me see what your love life is bringing towards you. This is going to be uh, interesting. Messages, please. Oh, my goodness. Fell right out of the deck. The tower in the reverse. Your lover's card in the reverse here. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Here. Let's see what angels are saying here. Your lover's card came up in the reverse, my darlings. Okay? In the reverse here. And the girl is going to walk you right through it. In the, in the tower that came up in the reverse, I feel like this person that wants to talk to you right now, they might have ghosted you. This person might have ghosted you in the past, okay? Um, I feel like they, pers they when they ghosted you, or maybe you might have ghosted them, is what I'm feeling. You might have ghosted them, but someone ghosted somebody, okay? And I felt this, this um, separation was definitely one without closure. Someone was probably got fed up and tired and walked away because your lover's card came up also in the reverse and i'm feeling that this person here really hurt you okay you was very hurt something happened and you were feeling very hurt here very hurt very hurt someone left and i feel like when this relationship broke up um the person either left feeling hurt or you left feeling hurt there was some definitely some hurt and pain going on here right someone was very sad because um, this in the five of cups here is letting me know in the reverse, my darlings, okay, that this person here, um, they might want to come back. They want to talk. They want to make amends here. I also feel like you might not want to go back. I don't know why you. I feel like you might not want to go back. I I don't know why I'm feeling here that maybe I'm getting a feeling in my spirit, y'all, that you might have ghosted your person. You might have ghosted your person um, because they want to talk, right? In your lover's card here that came up earlier in your uh, moving forward relationship part of your reading, someone wants to talk. And I feel like your person wants to talk, okay? It is you that might have ghosted them. Is what I'm feeling here. Because right here, someone does not want to make amend with the situation. Someone is ready to move forward with their life in the five of cups here. Conflicts is what I'm seeing here that had happened between the two of you, okay? There was a lot of conflicts going on. And I felt like your person might have betrayed you. And you had no um, other option but to walk away. You walked away. I feel like this person might have lied to you, okay? Um, I also feel like here in the Eight of Sword, I feel like this person might be still stuck, okay? I feel like they're still stuck. I don't know. They're still stuck. I feel like they're still stuck. They're still stuck um, with what had happened. Yeah, they're definitely stuck. I definitely don't see any movements going on on your hand like you want to make amends with this situation here. I feel like you just want to move on from it uh, and just even without any damn closure. I feel like you don't want any closure here because you're just tired and fed up. Tired and fed up. Let me see what's going to happen um, for the next three months. If there's love, new love coming in. New love has already found you. And just let me have some messages here. Let's see what's going to happen for Aries. As far as new love is concerned. Everyone wants to know about new love. So let's see what new love is bringing you, okay? New love, my darlings. New love for Aries, please. Let's see what's going on here. New love. New love coming in. Is new love coming in? For Aries, please. What is new love's intention towards Aries? Please, angels. What is new love bringing towards Aries? New love, please. 
All right, judgment in the reverse. All right. All right, so for your new love, your judgment showed up here in the reverse. And I feel like, um, I feel like a decision has to be made. And it's this, I feel like that decision that needs to be made has not been made yet. As far as bringing your new love in, I feel like you don't, you, you're not looking for new love right now. I, I just feel like that is not where you're thinking. Your mindset is not a new love right now. I feel like your mindset is on getting over that past and moving forward, making your money. Because um, the four swords here is let me know in the reverse here, okay, that you have definitely um, had your fair share and you have rested enough from this. Okay, whatever happened between you and this person here, you definitely have rested enough from this. You have had your fair share. And I feel like you have made a decision already, right? I do think that you need to take precautions though, right? Just, just, be, just take precautions, all right? Because I see an issue might be coming towards you and it might be tricky and it might be confusing to you, Okay. Um, because you're not ready to kind of move on for new love right now because you're still going through some things with the past. But I feel like there might be an opportunity that is coming in towards you with new love. So don't be um, timid and push away that, love, that new love that might be coming towards you, okay? Because right here, in the Ten of Pentacles here, okay? The Ten of Pentacles here is telling me right here that um, you're probably feeling very stuck, Right? Um, you're definitely not happy with the way how things ended here. You're definitely not happy. You're not really feeling like you wanted to open up and trust anyone again. You definitely wanted that happy ending though. You did need that happy ending, but it didn't really come to you the way how you really wanted it. But I do feel like you need to just open up and kind of get ready for that new love that new love wants to find you that new love is coming towards you but because of your past situation and how you felt you might be pushing away this new love to come towards you all right but new love is definitely in the air if you have not or if you have found that new love that already came towards you just be very careful okay because you don't want to use your past and damage what might be a good thing okay now, my darlings, that is your reading for today. I hope it did resonate with you. If it did, please let me know your situation. And also remember to pray because prayer works all the time. But most of all, always remember to seek first and you will always find.